right now from today's TMJ4. This is Live at 5 Saturday. And live at 5, rallying in Chicago, supporters of Dontre Hamilton and his family take to the Windy City to continue their fight for change. Good evening. Thank you for joining us. I'm Shannon Sims. Now, they're taking their protest across state lines. Supporters of the Hamilton family got an early start this morning, meeting at All People's Church and then driving to Illinois. Yona Govino has more on what they hope to accomplish. Family and supporters of Dontre Hamilton took to a much larger platform here in Chicago. Reverend Jesse Jackson Sr. led that rally. All eyes are glued to Dontre Hamilton's story. Jonathan Swims watched months of protests unfold on the news and decided to join the group for his first rally in Chicago. My people continue to march and uh, the family continue to get attention. Other people like me would come out and and join the protest. A few hours later, this was the scene inside the Rainbow Push Coalition. It's time for a change. I want, the, I want my Milwaukee family to stand. At one point, Reverend Jackson asked Dontre Hamilton's family and supporters to share the pulpit with him. Killing an unarmed black man is not justifiable. Killing a man for resting in a park is not justifiable. We stand with all the families. Like my sister, we can't sleep. A press conference followed the rally. I asked Reverend Jackson why it was so important for the Hamilton family to share their message here in Chicago. We want the violence to end. We want the violence to end. We discourage any acts of violence. That's, in the meantime, people marching uh, to end poverty. Poverty is a weapon of mass destruction. Reverend Jackson says he plans on joining the demonstrations in Milwaukee, but no word on how soon that'll be. In Chicago, Yona Govino, today's TMJ4.